Hello, Namaste. Harir and I are the entertainer, and I'm absolutely delighted to welcome you back to yet another book review on my YouTube channel. And this is an absolutely fascinating book that I'm going to review for you today. It is called as Hashtag Tata Stories 40 Timeless Tales to Inspire You by the amazing Harish Bhatt, who himself has been a part of the Tata Group for just so many years. Now, as far as I'm concerned, uh, this is not a book review. This is really a presentation about a very inspirational set of stories that come from the Tata Group. And this is not just a book. I would say it is just a little over 200 pages of inspiration. Every single word, every single page, every single anecdote, every single incident, every single story, every single personality that is captured in these 40 stories uh, by Mr. Harish Bhatt is an absolute inspiration, absolute classic. We all grown up admiring the Tata group ever since childhood and today we know why. Just amazing is the business model. The business model is more about national development. It is about serving people. It's not just about profit. The profit needs to come from the good that you do to people through your business model. That is That has always been the most incredible philosophy of the Tata group. Now, a 150-year-old organization, a 150-year-old group. So uh, just, just, just imagine the longevity. Just imagine just how long they have been around. And they are in practically every kind of business that you can think of within India. And also, I don't think there's any other company, any other group has done so much of philanthropy or set up as many trusts as the Tata Group has done. And it's an incredible story of one man who started a Jamshedji Tata, how he started his life, how he started his business, and how he was so obsessed with positioning India as a wonderful power, as something of great substance, as a, as a forward-moving country, uh, which is empowering its people. Uh, such an obsession for national development. Whatever initiatives it took in terms of the setting up mills or in terms of building the Taj Mahal Palace Hotel uh, or initiating the ideas for the hydroelectric project, uh, energy projects, uh, Institute of Science, just, just amazing. The kind of seeds that he sold for his uh, sons later on, Dorabji and Saratanji, to take forward. And then later on, the uh, the uh, the series of legends that the Tata Group has seen, uh, Darbari Seth, Rusi Modi, and of course, GRD Tata, and of course, uh, Ratan Tata. Now, what I find incredible, absolutely incredible about this book is India and the Tata Group are so intricately connected. Everything that you see good that's happening in India, somewhere or the other, in most of the things, at least in a very large number of things, the Tata group would have had a, a role in that, in, in touching it. Whether it's in this area of sports, sending the first Indian Olympic team, uh, even setting up the Prime Minister's Relief Fund, even making an economic blueprint for the economy. Uh, all these ideas have come from, from the Tata group. Uh, setting up uh, TIFR, TISS, uh, Tata Memorial Hospital. Look at the amount of philanthropy that goes into coming from the Tata Group. Look at the various businesses that they are into. Tea, whether it is motors, whether it is steel, is just incredible. Just, just amazing. It's telecommunication, uh, uh, it's just, just amazing. I mean, uh, I we cannot imagine in India without the contribution of the Tata Group. Uh, airline Air India was set up by. Uh, GRD Tata, and now they have uh, they have bought it back from the government. So, so and, and there are some absolutely incredible stories about GRD where he apologizes for coming three minutes late for a function. Can you imagine in those days? And a man of GRD stature is apologizing, saying, I'm so sorry, I'm late by three minutes. Uh, and, and the amount of leadership that he provided, how he nurtured young talent. Uh, and, and that's a recurring theme in the Tata leadership story. All the great leaders, Nani Palkiwala, Darbari Seth, Rusi Modi, uh, 
jrd tata ratan tata they have all nurtured some absolutely amazing people under them and and the tata legacy just seems to keep going on and on and on and on and on and on and i think we are very blessed to be living in a world where the uh, something like this uh, has happened in front of our eyes uh, and we have seen the tata group grow from strength to strength enter into various kinds of businesses never even once taking that foot off thinking about the good of people so just an ideal example of how a business needs to be conducted it's not only for profit you 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 enjoy the profit you do a great job you work hard uh, you be enterprising uh, but the core philosophy is the good of the people uh, the core philosophy is that people should benefit from the business model and very very importantly we should be contributing towards the development of the nation and much that's happening in india today in terms of national growth and development a very very large part of that contribution comes from the tata group and that's what i could gather from this this absolutely incredible book and i mean i even as i talk to you i i I'm, i'm feeling so charged up and energized it's changed me somewhere within uh because i've always done my business with the with a with a very similar approach that somewhere it should contribute to the development of people and make a small contribution in my own little ways for the development of the nation so as we dip, so i'm in the training business if i develop people make them more competent then obviously we are creating a better entrepreneurial workforce and we are also creating a, a fantastic professional workforce so it's a small contribution so we can take just 1% of uh the kind of work that the tata group has been doing just we, we are able to replicate that at just 1% each one of us it it's unimaginable the kind of amazing contributions that we can make to the development of the world to the development of the nation tata group has also inspired us to go global think global uh it's, a, it's it, in this book there's a very fascinating story about how the tetley tea brand was acquired by the tata group uh Uh, so so there are many such fascinating stories jrd's flight uh him participating in an aviation race uh, uh and uh, the work ethics uh, of of leaders like darbari said uh there is also this fascinating story about how the titan watches got created uh and and they provided a a a, a kind of a market Uh, case study uh, you know in the way the watches were created so every single story as i said every single page completely uh, inspires you so uh, do please do order this book uh, i think it's one of the absolute must reads uh, and uh, you'll find the link the amazon link to buy this book in the description uh, i hope you liked this book review to uh, i will come back with many more book reviews as i keep uh, reading uh, new books or review the ones that i have already read uh, please do subscribe to my youtube channel and i look forward to your comments uh, regarding the book reviews that i do and i'll see you very soon with one more book review till then do take good care of yourself god bless you and thank you very much